Hello everyone out there in betting land. Uh, this is Jim Feist in Las Vegas, which is really the betting capital of the world. Um, there's some interesting information coming out of Tampa. We just got word that the third player on the Tampa Bay Buccaneers has been diagnosed with MRSA. It's a very dangerous disease. It's not always uh, uh, treated effectively by antibiotics that we have, so it is very dangerous, and I hope all those players uh, recover from this. It is very, very dangerous, and I don't know psychologically how it affects the team. I would guess not very positively, so we have to keep an eye on that part of it, but the more important part is let's hope the players all recover. Uh, you know, speaking of uh, Tampa, they're starting Mike Glennon, uh, the Josh Freeman fiasco. He's gone. He's now with Minnesota. Uh, I don't know what's going on with Shiano, the coach, Freeman. That was all seemed to be very personal. Uh, you got Glennon, who is really not very experienced. He didn't show up all that well. You know, I mean, yes, he's a talented guy. He'd probably come along. But you, this whole league, we've got all these young quarterbacks, E.J. Manuel, Geno Smith, Mike Glennon, Blaine Gabbert, Matt Castle. Well, Matt Castle's been around a while. Ryan Fitzpatrick has been around a while also. We've got a lot of replacement guys. You've got Whedon coming back in to start now instead of Hoyer at Cleveland. You know, when you, when you look at it's hard to be an NFL quarterback, and it's hard to be, you know, it's hard to get that job. There's only 32 starting jobs in the world at that level. And a lot of these guys are really not starting quarterbacks. They're backups, and but they're starting. And then some of them, like at E.J. Manuel, Geno, Geno Smith, uh, they're young, and they're learning their jobs, and they still they look pretty good, although Manuel is out. Geno Smith looked like he could beat anybody last week against Atlanta. He looked great. But Mike Glennon, we have no idea. Blaine Gabbert's been around a few years. He has not developed. Uh, Matt Castle, he's kind of been a journeyman now. He's been around here and there. He tutored a little bit under Brady. He looks like he has the talent to do so, but when he's had the opportunities before, it hasn't worked out. Fitzpatrick got that big run a couple of years ago with Buffalo. He got hot. They gave him a $56 million contract. Then they ended up cutting him. Because what happens is you judge these guys like Flacco. He was always kind of an average guy. Not great, super great. Not a Brady or Manning or any kind of class like that. And they give him this monster contract off of last year's Super Bowl run where he was unbelievable for a couple games. And now this year he looks very average. Chances are, you know, we all have hot streaks. And we all have cold streaks. But it's, it's where you come in the middle. Where are you? Is Flacco an A, an A plus? Is he an A minus? Is he a B? So that has to be answered for all of these guys. But when you get guys on the field and you're putting money on them, I look for spots to bet against guys like this, or I look for spots where the odds makers feel that these guys have no chance. And you take the value, not only of the quarterback, but of the game plan. So if you have a quarterback that turns the ball over a lot, and they have a game plan where they can kind of protect him a little bit, and not give them too many opportunities to turn the ball over, you might get value with the team. So these are the kind of evaluations that I try to make when I make my bets each and every week, personally, and for the service. Now, like, I've been red hot. 47, 26, and one football run. 19 to nine with my NFL totals. And that includes uh, the, the Giants Bears over the other night, where they were over in the third quarter. I have a pair of dynamite NFL games. AFC total of the month on Sunday, and my NFL Monday night game of the year. There's some things about this Monday night game of the year that I really, really have keyed in on. I've keyed in on these type of situations and statistics over the years, and my record in this type of situation is outstanding. Both of these plays on the AFC total of the month on Sunday and the NFL Monday night game of the year are on sale right now online for $99 a piece. But you can have both these plays right now for $25 by calling 1-866-841-1655. $25, you get both those big plays for $25. Just call 1-866-841-1655. Let's make this a happy weekend so we can collect some money next week from our little friend, the BM.